everyone, Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome back to the Diamond Dimensions Mod Pack Modded Survival where today we have a little bit of an issue which I found when I was loading Diamond Dimensions. It was kind of annoying but check it out. I'm a Steve and I have no idea why. For some reason one of the mods I think that is um, checking for an update is crashing it at the beginning and I have no idea why. It must be something to do with the mod creator's server or something. I have no idea but today we're playing on offline mode which means we look like this but don't worry we match our clone which is Dan TDM, who's also a beautiful Steve. Check his little eyes out. But anyway <laughs> hopefully that fixes itself soon because I changed literally nothing. I just copy and pasted this whole pack to my desktop and then I copy and paste it back when I want to play it and it crashed. I was so mad. I was just like, how, how is that even possible? But narrowed it down to um, a checking of the online variety. Now I'm playing in offline mode. But anyway, let's carry on. Now Craig is talking to me, but my wife is still pretty damn mad. It looks like, no? I thought you were mad just now. She just changed. Beautiful. Well, last time, what did we do? We actually um, built this down here, which is pretty damn cool. It is, or oh, it was, the bunker. But I changed it into an underground... I want to change it into an underground lab, because I think that would be really cool. And we've got some stuff going on here. We have um, creeper cows behind there, which kind of caused a problem. But um, I also figured out this because, you know, I'm silly. And we didn't have enough light down here, because it's an underground farm. We're going to need some light here. So what I think I'm going to do is just mine out this little bit along here. And then um, just put, like, torches all the way across. I swear I'm hearing hissing still. I might be a little bit paranoid, but I'm just going to put torches all the way across here, and then we should be able to grow what needs to be grown. Uh, let's, have a, let's have a look and see if this works. There we go. That's better. There we go. Right then, where is... Uh, I haven't got any more seeds. No. No. Uh, what else have I done? Um, I need to go and clone, because we need to bring Far back today, and some of you didn't even know who Far was, which is interesting, because that means we've got loads of new Team TDM members checking out the Diamond Dimensions, which is awesome, and Far is... Um, oh, we're not going to be able to see him because I'm playing in offline mode. What a day to pick to be playing in offline mode. It's so ridiculous, but um, what Far is, is a pig man in a suit, and he farms for us automatically. It's sweet. You need to see it. But what I want to do with this underground bit is kind of change it into a little bit of a lab, kind of like the part we've got upstairs. I might move some of the stuff we've got upstairs downstairs. I guess I can't move too much. Maybe the cloning stuff. But let's go and I think I might set a waypoint down here, actually. Let's set one about here and go for waypoints. Um, new waypoint. We've got so many waypoints now. It's incredible. And it's going to be underground lab. There we go. So let's do this. And we want far back today. That is the that is the plan. We've got um, our little farm started up here. I want to continue it, I guess, all the way along here because we need to plant some, like, melons and... Uh, pumpkins and stuff but I also need to go and start the process of getting far down here and then he can begin kind of planting and stuff which is going to be awesome. Also want to grab kind of some, uh, let's grab some bone meal as well just because that will help the process and um, then we can get Dan TDM down there mining away his life but we do need to be careful because we're right next to a flipping, what's it called, um, like a massive labyrinth so I might have to go and check that everything's okay first uh, so they don't die. We do not want any clones to die because they're so hard to get now it's ridiculous um we can get baconator or maybe the new cat down here um sorry i didn't want to talk to you i wanted to eat my stuff i'm really sorry craig actually let's go for a high five um there we go there we go he says cheers beautiful what did i come up here for i came up for clone craft uh i might have um kind of left the test tube out here and it might have uh it might have despawned I think it's despawned, guys. I think it's despawned. Anyway, let's make another one uh, because I am silly. I think I remembered this randomly the other day. I was like, oh, my God. I completely just ran off and left that test tube cooking. So we need glass panes or just normal glass. Let's go and grab that a second. I want to just neaten up the whole TD, um, TD Empire. I'm playing the wrong series right now. <laughs> um, I want to um, neaten up the whole Diamond Dimensions world because it's looking kind of mishmash right now. We're getting there kind of. Look at all this. Oh my goodness. We're filling this up as well. How is that even possible? We've only got a stack left and then we're done. Oh no, the cobblestone is coming over here now. Um, let's take some of these fossils and make them into bone meal, because we're going to need some bone meal for now. Just to start along the uh, the process. Uh, I hear one of those rainbow chickens, and they're quite aggressive. We also need to kind of create more 
Um, we need to create more, what's it called, houses and stuff. Uh, because we've got way too many people in here. How are you doing, golems? These golems are looking epic, by the way. Uh, what, about, like, what was I going to do? I can't even remember. I'm just getting so distracted. There's so much I need to do here. Um, we need to fix all this because it got blown up twice by a creeper chicken and a normal creeper, I think. Or it might have been two creeper chickens, those punks. So what? there's another one. Look at it. I'm going to kill it. I'm going to kill it right now. Die. Die. Get out of here. No, don't do it. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Wow. I thought he was actually going to explode those pipes. I would have gone absolutely mad if he'd have done that. Right then, I don't think I'm going to refill the quarry today because I need to <laughs> I need to make more space. Loads more space. Uh, this might be near... Where is this in comparison to our place? Our underground lab is literally just here, so that's okay. We've got all this cool stuff here. Um, oh, the underground lab's literally just there. How close are we to it? We must be really close. We've got some bones in here as well. Nice. Oh, this is good. This is good. The loot. I need to explore this a little bit more, actually. Uh, because there's still places I haven't found. And there's loads of loot that's to be found as well. And lots of tools which seem random but are so worth it. Oh, God. Right. Get back in that hole. Get in that hole, you punk. Oh, and there's a creeper. Of course there is. Get in the hole. Get in the hole. <laughs> oh, they've gone. They've gone to the nether. Um... It's a little nether hole down here. It's a little bit random. But the underground lab is here. Wow. Um, I think mm, that's a bit dangerous, but let's teleport to it anyway. We just need to keep uh, a mind on that, just in case uh, we mine too far. That's interesting. I think we go that way and then we get it. Uh, that makes sense because we dug through. Okay, it makes complete sense. Right then, um, what do we got to do now? I think we need um, just to get far up in here. What was I? I was, I was going to find glass and I just ran down here. Why? Why did I do that? But anyway, let's get home and um, find some glass. Of course, I don't know where it is because I am silly. And we need to get this whole... What I'm going to do, I think, is organize a whole um, a whole organization thing. So I have one chest where I can shove all my stuff. And then just have pipes going off to the, um, the sides so that I can do that way. And then it will all sort itself out, which hopefully will sort out my problems. And <laughs> what are you doing, Stephanie? What are you doing? You're just kind of chilling outside. All right, we need one, two, three, four of these so we can make some glass panes. And then we can make some uh, test tubes. And um, there's a new way to get really cool stuff with uh, the clone craft mod. You can literally like take different things from certain mobs, uh, different like um, like this, like uh, the speed increase gene, and somehow create spawn eggs for different mobs, like you could before. It's really weird, but um, and I'm not sure how it works, but it sounds so awesome. And we might try that out soon because why not? It's a clone craft mod. We might as well. So what I do need to do is make sure that I don't mess up like I did last time. I messed up severely if you didn't see last week's episode. What I did was I had literally the whole process done for cloning myself. And then I um, I lost the egg, basically. I literally just destroyed it. Uh, <laughs> I should have put the egg um, in the crafting table and be able to do it that way. But I didn't for some reason. And I'm just so stupid for not doing that. Uh, right then, let's make, we need to put this inside a test tube just like this, uh, grab that out, and now we need to wash this needle, so let me put some of these things up here so it gets a little bit less confusing, uh, yeah, we need to wash this needle, if we could throw it in properly, we need to throw it in, there we go, and we also need to centrifuge this, so let's spin that bad boy, I love the animation of this, check it out, it's so smooth and awesome. Oh, wow. Um, yeah, and what I did last time is I threw the final tube into here and it washed it clean and just got rid of all the blood, which I guess makes sense and makes sure that I am literally the stupidest person alive. But anyway, uh, I want to tidy this up as well because there is another planet that we can visit, which is Mars, but we are going to need a tier two rocket. And I think we've got the plans for it, but we don't have... We don't have a way to get there because we need to make that rocket, which is going to take so much resources. So we need to get a couple of more quarries set up before we can go and do that. But I'm sure it will be it will be fine. It'll be absolutely fine. Right then. So when we're done with this, uh, let's just make ourselves an empty egg. So there we go. It's a little bit darker than a normal egg, if you can see the difference there. And that's what I didn't do last time, which was so dumb. But uh, this should be done. Uh, oh, it's just taking a while. All right, let's quickly... What should we do now? I need to go and bone mill all this stuff. So let's go uh, underground. Can we move these up or anything? Let me try. No, you can't. It's kind of annoying. But anyway, let's get down here. 
And what we're going to do now is bone meal this stuff. Uh, let's bone meal, bone meal. Oh, wait, it's nerfed, isn't it? We have to go up like this. I completely forgot that it was nerfed. Uh, here we go. I thought it was 1.7 for some reason. I've just been in 1.6 for so long, I haven't even realized this feature. Let's just bone meal as much as we can. And then just take it down. And we should have a nice little supply for far to start with, which is cool. And we also get uh, a little bit more um, seeds and stuff. So here we go. Let's do this. And I keep, I just keep thinking I'm seeing things and I'm not. It's so weird. But let's uh, fill this up, fill this up. And now we have, um, we need to make like another little chest for Far actually. Because he needs a place to, uh, a place to put all of his stuff. But for now it's going to be in here. Put that in there. And now we're going to have like renewable food as well, which is good. So hopefully the clone has finished and we'll go and grab that egg, which we will do right now. So waypoint, teleport home. This saves so much time uh, walking up and down the stairs and stuff. We need to set a waypoint really for uh, this back part. And I guess we could put a golem downstairs as well because, uh, a brand new one, because we don't want anyone to get harmed down there. We know there's like a, a thriving, what's it called, Thri thriving environment <laughs> for creeper cows down there. So you want to get them slammed before um, they actually do anything. Right then, now I think what we need to do is put the empty needle and the separated blood together to get human DNA. And now we, yes, I think this is it. Is this final process? Yes! Unactivated human egg! Beautiful, we've done it! We've done it together, guys, and now we need to wash both of these. Why do I always miss? Uh, let's wash this, and we now need to activate this egg, so this should work. Oh my god, it doesn't take away... I thought it was going to take away one chunk. It only takes away from this line to here. We can... We've got so much power. That thunderstorm was incredible. Right then, we've got one human egg. Wow, I'm actually so impressed. That is awesome. So we're just going to wait for this to wash up, and then we need to wash the empty needle as well. And you need to think about some more, um, not slaves, clones that we need, and what jobs we want them to do as well. Uh, there we go, let's throw that in there. Did that go in? Nice. Uh, so we'll wait for that to wash as well so we don't lose it. And this is exciting. Next time I think I'm going to make four clones at the same time. And I think I'll do that next episode so that we can decide what jobs we want them to do. We've got a farmer. I need to check what far can actually do. And then we can have like a guard and some really cool stuff like that. We've got Dan TDM who can do some mining. Just for now. And we can also have like some miners to just do stuff too. Because the quarry is awesome but it's not renewable. It's just uh, what well, it kind of is. So, yeah, there we go. It's all done. So let's go back beneath the the place, and we will rebirth far into the world. Check this out, guys. This is literally one of the best moments. Three, two, one, go. He's here. He's Steve right now. Oh, look, we match. We match right now. <laughs> A Steve world. Right then, let's um, right-click on him, and what we need to do is go into our options. Farming is going to be on. Curious off. His name is going to be Far. Now, his skin will change when we go into online mode. It's literally the worst time to have um, the offline mode on because we've got... I'm rebirthing Far into the world and he looks like a Steve. Why? Right, he's not going to fight. He's not going to follow. He's going to break blocks. Uh, break roughly, I guess. Pick up items on. Walk to items on. Retaliate off. Guard position off. Wander off. Uh, jump to attack. Stats on. He's not female. He's not female. Don't worry. Done. Right, we should give him a hoe now. Let's give him um, let's give him a brand new one. Let's give him a, a diamond one, because I think that's what he had before. I think, anyway. Oh, God! Oh, God! Oh, God, what's going on? What's going on? No! No, what's going on here? How is this even possible? What? What? Things are blowing up. Things are blowing up. Oh, she's summoning them. The little punk. That's how the zombies are getting in. What exploded? Oh... What is going on? Oh my god. Um, something exploded. Right, let's do a head count. Everyone's here. Everyone's at full health, which is awesome. Uh, I think it was out here. Yeah, I think one of the guards destroyed something. Yep, yeah, and my chest. Thanks for that, you creeper punk. I'm guessing it was a creeper anyway. Uh, let's get rid of just some feathers for now and get home because this is getting dangerous. He's healing. Oh, you're healing. That's okay. 
Uh, that's awesome. Right, let's get home. That was a bit crazy. So that is what has been happening. We finally figured it out. I'm not sure why the creeper came in. That is the mystery. But um, we've solved the mystery of the zombies. So basically, when one of those guys get in, when um, the pressure plates are activated, we might just have to get rid of the pressure plates because people are opening them left, right, and center and letting people in, which we do not want to be in. Look, there's literally zombies everywhere. Help me out, golems. This is why we got you. Come on. I want to see some golems. Yeah, I saw that. That was awesome. He flipped him. Uh, look at all these zombies. This golem's going over here. Golem, come over here. We need to, we need to flip this zombie over here. Come and flip this zombie. That would be awesome. Come on, zombies. It's okay. Um, I've got no golems to defend me. Come over here. Come over here. Come on. No. Over here. Oh, he's not going to do it. Die. <laughs> uh, let's go the other one as well, just so he doesn't make any issues. Right. Come here, you punk. I'm just going to slay you. Yeah. Don't hit me. That's rude. Right. We've solved the issue of that. So, basically, when one of those, um, the jungle rangers, I think they're called or something, they're kind of like a mini boss mob, and they will spawn in, um, zombies to help them fight, and that's why they're appearing in our house. Great. And I think they can attack through walls as well, which is a little bit of a glitch, but a little bit annoying. Um, are you mad now? Yeah, she's pretty annoyed. That's understandable, but at least no one died. Baconator has somehow moved inside a chest. That's interesting, and I'm distracted again. Um, it might be the golem that's aggravating them because they do spawn in uh, the jungle biome. So he's probably aggravating them and causing all kinds of ruckus. But let's go back to what we were doing, shall we? Let's uh, put this here. And what were we doing? We picked up a couple of random bits because uh, one of the chests exploded. So what we're gonna need to, oh, what's this? Uh, I got an ender stave. That's awesome. I think that summons zombies. That's awesome. I'm gonna keep that. Let's keep that in the valuables chest so we know where it is. Um, there we go. So what I need to do is... Oh, I remember what I was doing now. I need to grab a diamond hoe. I don't think... Oh, we've got one. Look at that. Perfect. Um, yeah, that's nice. Sweet. Waypoints. Uh, let's go underneath. And hey, Far, how you doing, buddy? I've got a gift for you. It's this. There you go. Diamond toe. Now, he should... Um, right, I kind of need some wood. So let's go back home again and grab some wood. I should really just make a note of what I need and then get it. So we need to make a chest for him to fill up his stuff um, and put all his stuff in, which is going to be handy. So let's make uh, a chest for him. And he should get busy on that. And he should mine up those, I think. Actually, I might have to... Yeah, okay. I might have to tell him what blocks he's allowed to break. I think that was the problem last time. So, this is the chest you need to fill for. And this is uh, blocks to break. Here we go. Do we need to go for wheat? No, we need to go for... Uh, let's try and find it here. Oh, it's really... Ah, oh, it's a long... Uh, it's a long process. He doesn't want to break saplings, uh, no leaves, sponge, even though that doesn't exist. Uh, he can break beds if he wants. Uh, I kind of need to just get him to break uh, wheat or whatever it's called. Maybe he'll do that anyway. I'm not sure. Torch, fire, uh, redstone dust, which is white randomly. Crops, found them. So we want to do crops, we want him to farm. Oh, we don't want him to break it though. Uh, I think that's it. That's all we need him to break at the moment. Uh, we could have... We're going to have pumpkins down here. I think I'm going to leave those for now. So, he has got uh, crops selected. So, now he should get to doing that when they're ready. I think, anyway. But um, what we're going to do now is, yeah, farming on. Everything should be good. Break, rock, break blocks. I think that's good. I think that's good. Now, I think he'll just fill it in this chest when he feels like it. But I'm going to give him uh, the seeds that I had before so that I can um, he can start the process. So let's uh, see what he does with these. Um, a gift from me to you, Far. There you go. We have some seeds. Uh, let's see what he does with the wheat as well. Let's give him half the wheat and see what he does with that. Um, here we go. Let's put uh, the wheat in his inventory there. And he should now be able to mine them up and put them in the chest. But I feel like I need to put him... I need, I need to give him the permission to do that. And I'm not sure why. Uh, let's go wander on. Come on, far. Move for me, buddy. Uh, let's try and break something. Let's break this and see what he does. Go on. Go on, you punk. Plant them for me. Plant them. You know you want to. He's not planting them. Why? Far, why, why are you disobeying me right now? You need to plant these. The seeds are calling you right now. He went to do it, but then changed his mind. Farming's on. 
uh, follow our spring, uh, pick up items, walk to items, retaliate. Oh, maybe he walked to the item. Oh, far, I don't know what you're doing right now. You can you can plant seeds. It's okay, right? Let's just leave him there to his own devices and see what he does later down the line. Uh, and he'll be tested. He'll be tested to see if he's working okay. Right, and let's get Dan TDM down here now and see if he can do some mining for us. Uh, Dan TDM, I need your uh, I need your services. Follow me, you little punk. Right, where is he? Follow. Here we go. Get down here. Right, let's come down here. He should follow us now. He's running like a beast. Jeez. Um, whoops. I kind of locked him out. Come down, Dan TDM. It's okay. Um, no, come down, please. Are you coming down? There we go. He's like on top of us, which is kind of weird. But we should be able to get him to mine, and I'm not sure how it works, to be honest. So let's see what happens. I think I can just get him to mine certain blocks. All right, let's get him to come down here. How are you doing, Dan TDM? I like your, your setup here. So what we can do is break blocks on, break roughly off, so he only breaks... Well, he kind of goes and finds stuff. Uh, I want him to retaliate on... Uh, walk to items, pick up items, um, stats on, farming off, curious off, and now I need to put the blocks to break. So, I entity. So I think he should just uh, retaliate actually. So that's good. And now we need him to break uh, stone, cobblestone, and see what he does now. Where are you going? Uh, no, that's a bad idea. Stop that. What are you doing? Why are you underneath there? Why, why are you breaking that? That's not cobblestone. I told you to break cobblestone. Oh, wait. What was that noise? None of this is cobblestone, is it? We need him to break modded blocks. Can he do that? Uh, let's see if he can. It might be at the bottom. Oh, yeah, he can. Sweet. I was scared for a second then. But we need him to break um, just the... I need to find out what blocks they are, actually. Um, let's see if we can get to it. We need him to break... Just the new underground biomes mod stuff. If I can find it. I feel like I'm near there. I'm near there. There we go. Right, we need him to break. Oh, no, wait. This is... Tr uh, what is this? Oh, I forgot what it's called. It's called... All right, here we go. We need him to break... I need to find out what this is, actually. So, let's mine a little bit up and see what this is. I need him to break... Stop going for it. Uh, I need him to break basalt cobblestone. So let's see if we can get him to do that. Blocks to break bas basalt cobblestone. Back. What will he do now? Far? Okay, far. Have I told far to do that? Yep, I've told far to do that. Right then, um, quick, stop. Blocks to break. Because uh, he's going to go underneath. Whew, that was close. Right, this is basalt cobblestone. I need the smooth stuff, so maybe it's just basalt that we can do. It's kind of confusing right now, so blocks to break. We want him to break uh, B-A-S-A -A basalt. Does that work? Oh, yes. Yes, it's working. Right, far, I don't... Entities to attack. I want you to um, not pick up items right now. Uh, walk to items off, pick up items on. There we go. So this is working now, but I'm very wary that he's just kind of gonna go and do random stuff that I don't want him to do. Uh, let me far far follow me, please. You're getting in the way, buddy. Is this far um, options? Yeah, this is far. Like right, follow me because you're in the way. You're in the way, punk. Come over here. Oh god, they're both following me. How is this possible? All right, options. Follow off. Curious. Where's curious? Off. Wander off. Nice. Right, where is Dan TDM gone? He's kind of zipping around the place. Dan TDM, just chill out. Don't take out too many of this. Uh, this is going to be a problem, to be honest, I think. Right, what could we, maybe we could do this. Uh, let's get him to stop breaking um, blocks for a second. Uh, blocks to break. BAS. This. So let's do that so he's not breaking anything. Stop breaking stuff. Dan TDM, chill out. Did he put it in here? Oh, he's breaking these. Okay. So, uh, what I want him to do is kind of get... Um, if I get him to break iron ore, and then because his break roughly is on, he might go and get it. So, let's see what happens now. He should break blocks just to get iron ore. And if there's no iron ore, then he shouldn't need to go and get it, which is cool. And then it stops him destroying the whole place. So, as you can see, he will break that and go crazy and try and work out how to get it. But that could also pose as a problem... 
Why are you- you're so crazy right now. Like, literally so crazy. There we go. Right, you got it. Um, where are you off to now, though? Where are you going? Oh, you went to collect it. And... Where are you going? Where are you going, sir? Where are you, where are you going? He's just kind of... A little bit confused. He's just running around like a crazy man. Oh my goodness. What is going on here? Right, you know what? You can stop. Blocks to break. Iron. Stop. He is crazy. He is legitimately crazy. Stop! Okay, don't stop. It's alright. It's alright. Right, let's see if far, if I um, bone meal something. I don't have any bones, do I? What has he got in his inventory, actually? Just wheat and a little bit of cobblestone. He's got iron ore. Chicken randomly as well, which is interesting. Let me go and grab some bones. Why is Dan TDM going so crazy all of a sudden? It's not like him whatsoever. Let's grab these bones and get rid of that. He's following me now. Um, I need to turn off follow. Come here. Options. Follow off. Sprint. Oh, that's why he's running everywhere. He's got sprint on. All right, Dan TDM. Chill out. Just chill out, man. Chill out, Jesus. Right, uh... Okay, these guys have come home. Let me go and sleep because I don't want anything crazy to happen again. Oh, this is this is this is difficult stuff. The clones just go nuts for everything. And I think what I want them to do is just farm. So I'm just going to have farmers down here because otherwise they're going to get confused with each other and the mining is a bit sporadic. By that I mean they just go everywhere and mine everything and won't keep the old uh, the, everything like in place. So let's test if far is working, and, um, oh, I think he did, let's mine, yes, nailed it, oh my god, so it only replaces, um, he only replaces the stuff that, so if he, he doesn't replace blank blocks, but he will replace stuff that he mines up, which is awesome, that is awesome, and we need him to pick up stuff as well, so options, we need him to uh, pick up items and walk to items as well. So there we go. He's picked up uh, the seeds now. He should pick up the wheat as well. Nicely done, Far, buddy. I don't know how I get him to put it in the chest, though, because I did have that with the old one. Uh, pick up items, walk to... I can't remember how to do it. But um, we'll sort that out later. At least he is fine and ready to work. Good job, Far. You deserve, like, a chest plate or something. We should make him a chest plate. Anyway, <laughs> not for now. Right, at least we've got some stuff going. We've got, they mine pretty damn quickly as well, these guys. And um, that's impressive to me. I'm really impressive. So I really, what is that noise? That is a weird noise. I, I think I want to shut those spiders up because they're kind of annoying. But I feel, oh, oh no. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to shut those spiders up right now. Let's do that, shall we? No! No, 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 no. Don't even think about it. Don't even think about it. Stop. Options. Oh, God. Um, he's going crazy. Uh, fast. Stay away. Let's just kill these guys. All right. Kill these guys. Kill these guys. Nicely done. And, oh, no. No, there's... How are there spiders falling from above? Let's uh, block this up so fire doesn't decide to come down. Because he will just, like, have the urge to just pick up everything and we've got this kind of spider dungeon oh oh no oh no this is getting worse i should not have done this <laughs> get out of here um oh nice he's got some decent stuff on him let's get rid of that get rid of that don't want the shovel but i want i guess they're okay get out of here get out of here get out of here i'm also interested by that nether thing that's underneath too which is interesting uh let's get rid of these getting some good stuff from these wow Really good stuff, which we can use for our clones. So I'm just going to light this up. Oh, almost fell down. Almost fell down. Uh, something's glitching out there. Whew, this is weird. I just want to get rid of these spiders because they're really loud. Get rid of these. And they're destroying everything. They're destroying my sound space. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. And get out of here as well. All right, let's uh, make sure we know what we're doing. All right, I thought it was a massive room for some reason. It's okay. It's not. Oh, wow. What do you got? Spade. He's got a spade. He's got a spade, everyone. And now he has nothing. What did you have on you? So we've got some cool stuff. Uh, we've got an iron sword, which is nice. Very nice. Uh, got some woods. I kind of need to get rid of some of this stuff. Because otherwise I'm just going to keep picking it up. I want the iron sword so I can give it to Far. 
So that's pretty good. Right, we've lit this up now, so nothing should spawn down here. And it should be as quiet as possible. It should be, anyway. Uh, this is kind of intriguing. I want to know what's down here, but I'm not going to go there yet. I'm just going to go back up here and give um, Far some stuff, just in case he gets attacked. Come here, buddy. It's okay. It's okay, buddy. You don't need to pick up anything. Uh, let's give him uh, this uh, unusing. I don't know what unusing is. Unusing. Oh, I think that's a bad thing from the blood, blood mod. No, not blood magic. Evil craft mod, which uh, kind of makes you use stuff more, which is bad. But um, it seems to like randomly generate with stuff, which I guess is cool. So let's fill this up, and we've got a farm. We've got a farm going. We've got far, which I'm very interested to um, go back into online mode so we can actually see him in all his glory. Uh, we've got a little bit more space to work with now that we've got all the spiders out of the way. There's only really labyrinths below us. So what I'm going to do now is end out the episode, I think, and then we're going to get more clones, and a literally this whole underground bit is going to be a farm, and it's going to be sweet. We're going to have pumpkins. We're going to have sugar cane. Just everything. Oh, and animals. I want to get animals down here too because there's a way with build craft where you can kind of shear and milk things, which is good. So I'm going to work that out. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'm glad that Far is back. I'm upset he's not a pig, though. He needs to be a pig very soon. You guys who have seen him before will know what happened. But anyway, thank you so much for watching, guys. Hopefully, Far will figure it out his uh, figure out his way of life. Look at this. What is he doing? But anyway, thank you so much for watching. And if you did enjoy this episode, then please do leave a like. That would be greatly appreciated. And if this happens to be the first video that you've seen by me, then please do subscribe and join Team TDM today for daily Minecraft videos. Thank you so much for watching again, guys. And I will see you all next time. Goodbye.